Um, yeah, it's just that some brothers got too much time on this on on this um thing, on on the internet, right? Whatever you put your energy to or uh, your thought energy to, the most. It's going to be a big part of your life. So a lot of these dudes, man, they go to sleep, you know, thinking about the drama they're going to create tomorrow, uh, thinking about the fake beef they're going to create, who they're going to beef with. Um, they really, you know, a lot of these dudes, man, they got this planned out. You understand what I mean? So this is all that's on their mind. They're creating this drama. And like I said before, it's, it's what you call the sub media. You know, these dudes that's about 40, 50 years old. They got drama all over the world um, in their old neighborhoods. They can't go back and they can't take that energy out on the people who probably did something to them. So now they're poking holes at famous people that they know that's not going to get at them. You know what I mean? You got to pay attention to what's going on. These dudes is making, um, you know, stories, phony stories about uh, famous people, people that's famous now, you know, it might be a story that they heard, they get on Facebook, and they recite the conversation, and they put little things into it, maybe that they heard, like in a rap song or something, this is what they're doing, yes, it's called fake news, um, you know, a fake conversation, it's just like somebody in real life, kicking it with you, you kicking it back with them, but the conversation is all fake. There's no meaning in the conversation or anything. You just kicking it to kick it. Until that day you wake up and you're like, yo. It's the same thing with this person every day. They wake up angry at the world and get on Facebook. Right? Instead of bringing it to themselves. The, the real person, the real culprit is themselves. These people don't even know you. Of course, they're not holding you back. The Illuminati. And all, and all of these names you make up or you hear the name and you just repeat it. The Illuminati is holding you back. Okay. All right. You're the biggest, baddest gangster killer in the world. None of these toughies in the street could do nothing to you. But the puny Illuminati. Come on. Tell it to somebody else, right? These dudes is making fake stories, fake news. And they're selling it. Actually, they, you know, actually, you're buying it. They post it. You give them 50,000 views. You, you're part of it, too. Yup. Absolutely. They're part of it, too. Me, myself, I might look at some of that stuff once or twice. We all are part of it to a certain extent. I watch it maybe once or twice. And I don't watch it no more. And sometimes I don't even watch the whole thing because I could I could pretty much imagine what these dudes are saying to each other, man. These dudes is inviting each other to, to their man, to their to their private part, inviting each other to it proudly. I can imagine what they're saying about each other, but it's the under media that's helping create this drama and they're feeding right into it. They're feeding right into it. You got dudes that's not even blood. That's, that's now just getting the red bandana and saying that they blood and now you got someone else arguing saying they not but really bringing um, you know light to their name you know bringing light to their name controversy and all of that it all sells and it's money right now